In this video, I will give you a quick intro to Filecoin. Filecoin is a decentralized storage solution for Web3. It's very popular with more than 32 petabytes of data already stored on it. If you are new here, I'm Julian and on Eat the Blocks, I help Web2 developers transition into Web3. Filecon was founded by Protocol Labs in 2014. It was built on top of IPFS, a decentralized file system also built by Protocol Labs. With IPFS, you can store any type of file on a public network of computers, also called IPFS nodes. Contrary to centralized storage like Amazon S3, on IPFS, there is no centralized point of failure, which makes it censorship resistant. On IPFS, there is no guarantee of data availability. It's up to IPFS nodes to keep your data. To incentivize IPFS nodes to store data long term, you have to pay them. Falcon was created as a protocol on top of IPFS to create a marketplace for data storage. Its reference client is called Lotus and is written in Golang. On the one hand, Falcon miners run Falcon nodes and offer long term storage on top of IPFS. And on the other hand, Falcon users want to store data on IPFS through the Falcon protocol. Users pay Falcon miners for data storage using the field cryptocurrency. Falcon uses a consensus algorithm called proof of space time. Falcon miners have to stake some field coin before they can participate in the network. Thanks to the proof of space time algorithm, the network can verify whether a miner actually stored data. If a miner did its job and stored the data as expected, it's rewarded by field coins. Otherwise, the miner will lose the field coins that were staked. The field coin has a market cap of $3 billion and is the 42nd crypto. Besides paying miners, it's also used for the governance of Filecoin. To start building on top of Filecoin, you can either run your own Filecoin node using the Lotus client, or more simply, you can use a service like Infra to connect to the network. You can also use Filecoin.js, a JavaScript library to interact with the Filecoin network. And you can inspect transactions with Filefox, the block explorer of Filecoin. And for development, you can use the testnet of Filecoin. So that's it for this quick intro to Filecoin. As I mentioned, Filecoin is built on top of IPFS. And next, if you want to have a quick introduction to IPFS, you can watch this other video on my channel. I will see you there.